Welcome to my passion travel channel and I invite you I make content on tourism and subscribe to my channel and put a little like. Stripwafel. A stripwafel is a famous Dutch treat consisting of two thin waffle cookies with a caramel syrup filling in the middle. They are often made fresh and can be found at street markets and food stalls. Stripwafel is a beloved Dutch treat and a popular street food snack. It consists of two thin waffle cookies with a layer of caramel syrup filling in the middle. Here's more information about stripwafels. Stripwafels are made from a dough made with flour, butter, sugar, eggs, yeast, and spices like cinnamon. The dough is pressed into a waffle iron to create thin, round waffle cookies with a distinctive pattern. After baking, the cookies are sliced horizontally, and a layer of caramel syrup, called stroop, is spread between the two halves. The syrup is made from caramelized sugar, butter, and a touch of cinnamon. Traditionally, stripwafels were made in the town of Gouda in the Netherlands, but they have become popular throughout the country and beyond. Today, you can find strip wafels in various sizes, from mini bite-sized versions to larger ones that fit perfectly on top of a coffee cup. Strip wafels are often enjoyed as a street food snack in the Netherlands. You can find them freshly made and served warm at street markets, food stalls, and specialty shops. The warmth of the waffle cookies helps to soften the caramel filling, creating a gooey and indulgent treat. In addition to being a popular street food, strip wafels are also commonly found in supermarkets and souvenir shops, packaged in individual packs or in decorative tins, making them a popular edible souvenir. Strip wafels are best enjoyed with a hot beverage such as coffee or tea. Many people like to place the strip wafel on top of their warm cup, allowing the steam to heat the cookie and melt the caramel filling slightly, creating a delightful combination of textures and flavors. If you have the chance to try strip wafels in the Netherlands, it is a must-try treat that showcases the country's culinary delights and provides a deliciously sweet experience. Pat it or fry it, these are the Dutch versions of French fries. They are typically thicker and are served in a cone-shaped paper cup. Dutch fries are commonly accompanied by a variety of sauces, such as mayonnaise, ketchup, peanut sauce, or curry ketchup. Pat it or fry it, French fries, are a quintessential street food in the Netherlands. They are a beloved snack and a popular accompaniment to many meals. Here's more information about this Dutch street food favorite. Pat it or fry it in the Netherlands refers to the country's version of French fries. They are typically made from peeled and thick-cut potatoes, resulting in a chunkier fry compared to the thinner French fries found in some other countries. The potatoes are deep-fried until golden and crispy on the outside while remaining soft on the inside. Pat it or fry it is often served in a cone-shaped paper or cardboard container, making it easy to enjoy while walking around. It is common to find them accompanied by a wide variety of sauces, which adds to the unique Dutch experience. The most popular sauce is mayonnaise, known as pat it met or fry it met, but other common options include ketchup, curry ketchup, peanut sauce, and combinations of these sauces. Besides the classic mayonnaise or ketchup, you might also encounter local specialties such as special sauce, which combines mayonnaise, ketchup, and chopped onions, or drulog sauce, which includes mayonnaise, saute sauce, and chopped onions. These sauce combinations add extra flavor and create a tasty twist to the traditional fries. Pat it or fry it can be found at food stalls, street vendors, and dedicated fry cot fry stands throughout the Netherlands. They are a popular street food option, especially in urban areas, tourist spots, and during festivals and events. Trying Dutch fries is a must when visiting the Netherlands. Whether you enjoy them plain or with a variety of sauces, they are a delicious and satisfying street food snack that showcases the Dutch love for fries.
Kibbling. Kibbling is battered and deep-fried chunks of white fish, usually caught. It is often served with a side of remoulade sauce and lemon wedges. Kibbling is a popular street food option, especially in coastal areas. Kibbling is a popular street food in the Netherlands that consists of battered and deep-fried chunks of white fish. It is a delicious seafood snack that can be enjoyed on its own or as part of a meal. Here's more information about kibbling. The most common type of fish used for kibbling is cod, although other white fish such as haddock or pollock may also be used. The fish is typically cut into bite-sized pieces or chunks and then coated in a seasoned batter made from flour, eggs, and spices. The batter gives the fish a crispy and golden exterior when deep-fried. Kibbling is often served with a side of remoulade sauce, which is a tangy and creamy sauce made from mayonnaise, pickles, capers, and herbs. The sauce complements the flavor of the fried fish and adds an extra element of deliciousness. This tasty seafood snack is commonly sold at fish stands, fishmongers, and street food markets throughout the Netherlands. You'll often find it served in paper cones or containers, making it easy to eat while strolling around. Kibbling is a popular choice among locals and tourists alike, and it is especially enjoyed in coastal areas where fresh seafood is readily available. It is a delicious and satisfying snack that showcases the Dutch love for fish and seafood. So, if you have the opportunity to try kibbling in the Netherlands, I highly recommend giving it a taste. It's a delightful and flavorful street food that highlights the country's culinary traditions and coastal influences. Kassoffel. A kassoffel is a deep-fried snack made with melted cheese enclosed in a crispy crust. It's a popular vegetarian option in Dutch street food and is often served with dipping sauces. Kassoffel is a popular Dutch street food snack that is loved by cheese enthusiasts. It is a deep-fried snack made with melted cheese enclosed in a crispy crust. Here's more information about kassoffel. The main ingredient of a kassoffel is cheese, typically a Dutch cheese like Gouda or Edam. The cheese is cut into rectangular or square slices and then coated in a batter made from flour, water, and spices. The coated cheese is then deep-fried until the crust becomes golden and crispy. The result is a delightful combination of gooey, melted cheese encased in a crispy shell. The contrast of textures and the savory flavor of the cheese make kassoffel a beloved snack in the Netherlands. Kassoffels are commonly served at street food stalls, snack bars, and fast food establishments throughout the country. They are often enjoyed on their own or accompanied by dipping sauces like ketchup, mayonnaise, or sweet chili sauce. Although kassoffels are typically made with cheese, you can also find variations that include additional fillings such as ham, salami, or vegetables. These variations add extra flavor and texture to the snack. Kassoffels are a popular vegetarian street food option in the Netherlands as they provide a satisfying and flavorful snack without meat. They are a convenient grab-and-go food that can be enjoyed while exploring the streets or as a quick bite between activities. If you're a cheese lover or simply looking for a delicious and satisfying snack, trying kassoffel is highly recommended. It offers a taste of the Dutch culinary scene and showcases the country's fondness for cheese in a delightful and portable form. Vietnamese Spring Rolls These fresh and flavorful spring rolls have gained popularity in the Netherlands. Filled with vegetables, rice noodles, and herbs, they are often accompanied by peanut sauce for dipping. While Vietnamese spring rolls may not be native to the Netherlands, they have gained popularity as a street food option due to their delicious flavors and fresh ingredients. Vietnamese spring rolls, also known as fresh spring rolls or summer rolls, are a light and refreshing snack. Here's more information about Vietnamese spring rolls. Vietnamese spring rolls are made by wrapping a variety of fresh ingredients in rice paper. 
The fillings typically include rice vermicelli noodles, fresh vegetables such as lettuce, cucumber, and bean sprouts, herbs like mint and cilantro, and optionally, cooked shrimp, chicken, or tofu. The combination of flavors and textures creates a tasty and nutritious snack. To assemble a spring roll, you soak a sheet of rice paper in warm water until it becomes pliable. Then, you place the desired fillings in the center of the rice paper and carefully roll it up, similar to a burrito or wrap. The rice paper holds everything together, creating a translucent and delicate roll. Vietnamese spring rolls are often served with a dipping sauce, such as nuoc cham, a sweet and tangy fish sauce-based condiment, or hoisin peanut sauce, which adds a nutty and slightly sweet flavor. While not traditionally Dutch, you can find Vietnamese spring rolls at various food markets, food trucks, and street food events in the Netherlands especially in larger cities with diverse culinary scenes. They offer a refreshing and healthier street food option for those seeking a break from heavier or fried snacks. Vietnamese spring rolls are enjoyed as a light meal or snack that can be eaten on the go. Their fresh ingredients and vibrant flavors make them a popular choice for those looking for a balanced and tasty street food option. So, if you have the chance to try Vietnamese spring rolls in the Netherlands, they provide a delightful taste of Vietnamese cuisine and a refreshing alternative to other street food options.